Hey guys, it's Narell here and welcome to another part of my 2015 sketchbook flip through. In this video, you guys will be only getting one sketchbook because this is actually one of my thicker ones. So I'm like, I'm just going to keep the focus on this one and I believe the sketchbook is a Daler and Rowney sketchbook in the color black because you can get, I believe, three colors of this sketchbook. You can get black, red, I know there's blue, and I think there's yellow. Don't count me on that one, but I know black, red, and blue is the color options you can get. So um, with this sketchbook, it's actually a hundred pages, I believe, and I started this sketchbook on March 18th, 2015, and I completed it April 28th, 2015. So this sketchbook took me a month and 10 days to finish, and a lot of you guys are gonna be like, Night Rail, how did you finish a 100-page sketchbook in a month and 10 days? And reason being is just that I sketch a lot. Like I literally would like spend maybe 10, 15 minutes on a sketch because when I sketch, I don't make my sketches finish pieces like I see in other artists' sketchbooks and that's kind of why they take a longer time to finish their sketchbooks because I just don't like refining my sketches. Well, you will see in this sketchbook that I did do some completed artwork, but I never did finish them. I think the only finished complete artwork I did was my Zuko and Katara piece that I did way back when because guys, I literally still and will always ship Zuko and Katara. Don't kill me with that. I mean, I love her with Aang, but I'm just like, Zuko and Katara. And I think I watched that episode of Avatar when they both got stuck in like an ice cave, I believe, or a earth cave. It's been ages since I've seen Avatar, but it's that episode when they got stuck together and I am like... Can I just ship you guys even harder than I do now? So yeah, that's the only finished piece I have in here. So, as you're seeing me do here, I actually switched the sketchbook to the back and I actually started drawing that way because with glue bound sketchbooks, the pages don't lay flat easy and you have to kind of bend it down just to get your paper to lay flat and I hated that. Like I could not stand doing that. So I'm like, let me just draw from the back forward to actually solve the problem for me. And it worked, it really worked, but then again, it didn't work because no matter how much you turn the sketchbook front or back, you still gotta get the pages to lay flat. So that's the reason why I'm a spiral bound sketchbook lover because it's so much easier. And yeah, a lot of people say spiral bound sketchbooks are annoying because your hands hit the spirals. But the thing about it is you could turn it landscape way and you don't have to worry about the spirals. So all in all, it just depends on you as a person. But yeah, getting back to the sketchbook. So um, this is actually a comic I made of Naru and Chio when I actually was designing their older looks because when I was doing that, I didn't publicize how they looked when they were older. I believe I skipped those pages, believe or not, when I actually did the actual flip through of this sketchbook because I didn't want to spoil it for you guys. So their older looks was done two years ago. It's just that I never advertised it because I really wanted that to be a secret within the story. But now I draw them in their older looks all the freaking time. You guys are probably then like Nyrell. Go back to them when they were 16. And I'm like, I'm gonna try that. But um, yeah, I, I, I always love doing comics of Naru, Chiyo, Naru even, because I found it so funny and so fun to do. Because those three are just golden. I just really love that. And now you have Cassie and the family. You have Rayo now in the family because Rayo wasn't made then. Yeah, Rayo was not made when I had this sketchbook. So Rayo, I think Rayo was made in 2016, I believe. So yeah, he, he didn't exist. So you have Rayo now and then you have Hayden 
and then you have Naoya, so the family grew, and then you have Juju, you have Manju, so the family just grew to what it is, and I just really love the Naru fam. <laughs> so anyways, um, right now you'll see a lot of the sketches I did that had glitter pen, because I think it got like a, pa a pack of three glitter pens, and I was obsessed with those pens and I'm like Nyrell do not add glitter to every single drawing you do after that drawing <laughs> because I would have just went obsessed with that glitter pen and I think we're reaching the last few pages of this sketchbook and another thing I wanted to note you saw a lot of my older characters I believe you saw my character DJ um, you saw my character Shoya, not too much, so I think just DJ and Shoya, and those two characters still exist, but they just don't exist because I just don't have the time and love to bring them back again. So yeah, now the sketchbook is in me, and thank you guys so, so much for watching, and stay in tune for the next part of my 2015 sketchbook clip through. Bye guys!